Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back, man. We're here today with Mashal, episode four, man. Our boy Mash is in the school. He's doing his thing, man. Honestly, Mash can't get checked. No one can beat this man. No one can use magic, out magic him. No one can out strength him. He can literally do anything he has to do. And he will do what he has to do to get to where he has to get to. You know what I'm trying to say? So, yeah, Mash defeated uh, Cavill and the vice principal last episode. And these two were people who terrorized students to a degree where uh, students were quitting school you know what i mean they were dropping out because of how bad these two treated them and we know that cavill is connected with the uh the ministry of magic so we're gonna be in some trouble with them now that mash had beat him up so we're gonna see how this episode goes without further ado let's jump right into this man i don't even think it's called the ministry of magic i think that's just harry potter oh shit oh yeah we was um playing uh quidditch <laughs> Duello. That's what they call it. That's. I mean. Yeah, you should. Hey, yo, not the narrator like throwing shade too. Like, nah, yeah, go home. You're not doing shit. Ah, <laughs> yeah. What are you talking about, my dude? This dude put his stuff in our mouth. What? Wait, pause. You know what I mean? Like, we ain't say that shit. This guy is goofy. This guy has to be high. Hey, yo, my boy's smoking that bamboo. <laughs> Wait, but aren't, aren't you flying with your brooms because of magic? How is... That doesn't make sense. I ain't gonna lie. If you put everything into this shit, you wouldn't have recruited him. You don't know what he brings to the table. He already in a match. No training, no ma Damn! That wasn't no accident. Damn, they sc 50 points? Damn! Yo, my boy body frail? How you break your arm already? Respect. Oh, my boy Mash gonna go crazy! What? Bruh! What the heck? He's kicking his legs a lot! <laughs> my boy is like an airplane! How does he move? Oh my gosh! My boy got an arm? Nah, ain't no way they, they can't win. Nah! Hey, yo! Yo, Mash is a different breed, man! <laughs> what the heck? Yo, Mesh! Yo, put him in the league. Put him in the league. You see how they changed up? Sorry for telling you to go home. Like, nah, F you guys. Hey, our first coin? I'm never doing that again. Yo, Tom, I'm not doing it again. No more. <laughs> Oh shit, who this guy watching our um stats? That's Fuji? Oh no, this is someone else. This is the guy from the opening. Interesting. Yo, Mash got a lot on his plate, huh? Duello, studying. Bro, stop! No way you fell asleep. Ah, oh, shit. No. Lance Crown? That's a cool name. He's a total hottie. 
Ain't no way you can do this and get away with this shit. This, yo, where are the teachers? This school crazy. He took them and put them in a freaking magic vase. Yeah, sure. この世界のほとんどのものが1000万同士に相当する。うん。1000万同士。10万人に1人の割合でこの世界に存在する。Damn. Ooh, my boy Mash is not scared. Yo, he is, I ain't gonna lie, he is pretty strong. I give it to him. Yo, my boy is just camping out. Go home. What the heck? <laughs> He has gravity, man. So if you're around, no one can get coins. Like, what's up? What? My boy pulled the root out the ground? Nah! Ooh! Oh my god! My boy Mash is not playing! Is that his sister or something? Like. <laughs> He's a <lolly> god! <laughs> I have a sit, bro. That's not any better. <laughs> what? Yeah. What do you think it is? You answer. Damn. <laughs> yeah. What? Bro, F your little sister. I ain't gonna hold you. Like, bro, I don't even know that little girl. This dude, my little sister. <laughs> like, bro, get out of here, dude. Oh. Why? But what? Why are you doing this for your sister? Like, would she... Huh. If he's saving kids who get bullied, why he bullying now? What the heck? Damn, she's sick. Five years, like to live, or five years to have her powers? What? Nah, no way. Now these parents are trash. Like they was like, why did she have to be born under us? Like what type of shit is that? Hey yo, my boy. Got, hey, yeah, he he gonna go crazy. He get the gym gear on. Yeah, you're done. Neither exists for me. Oh my, yo, my boy, a track star. Yo, he a different breed. Nah, my boy defied gravity, time, speed, everything in the world right now.
That's facts. We we literally have similar goals to some degree. Ah, shit. Okay. Damn! Oh, you didn't have to give it to us, Lance. You cool. <laughs> Man, it's like, hey, these dudes are annoying. I, I don't blame him. Bro, they all came out the bottom. Homie, like, bamboo. You got lemon on the side. Like, hey, yo, man, I'm gonna marry you. And you got freaking dude crying on my leg. It's like, damn. Maybe I should have, like, kept them in here a little bit. I ain't gonna lie. Maybe I should have went to my room and left them in the bottle for a couple days or so before I let them out. Like, bro, y'all annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that shit is hilarious. Man, nah, the magic barrel is effed up, bro. I ain't gonna hold you. This world, I already said it since the first episode. This world that we live in in Mashal is messed up. If you don't have any magic, you're done up in this world. They gonna def like they re really gonna make you wanna kill yourself. They'll push you to the edge of trying to kill yourself. You will feel unneeded. You will feel unwanted. You will be hopeless. And you know to go from having magic, like magic is like when you have that, you you're privileged. You get to live. You have your life. If you don't have magic, bro, the the magic barrel, they'll do whatever they do to you. They'll kill you. Th your, your life means nothing, and that sucks. I hate that shit. I think that's the most wackest thing of this world. Why is that a thing? Just because I don't have magic? So you telling me because I don't have magic, I can't just mind my business? You guys already got all the power. I can't do shit to you. Why does it matter? And now they just explained this episode that there's a thing for rare occurrences where someone could have two magic marks or maybe multiple and that would mean they're more powerful with magic and this happens every like one out of a hundred thousand people that's kind of crazy i ain't gonna lie that's crazy so our boy lance is a rare breed like there's not many out there like him you know what i mean we'll probably see a couple more but not that much you know what i'm trying to say because that is actually pretty rare one out of every hundred thousand people has the double you know mark that's wild and yeah seeing his situation with his sister anna who just got this disease that was stripping her of her magic you can see how trash her parents were her parents out here like hey yo why does she have to be born under us like what bro your daughter is losing her magic ability and you just go hand her off to the to the bureau of magic you just go do that you're not gonna fight anything. You just go, hey, yo, our daughter. Well, I mean, she's done. Like what? That's whack. Hey, that's not how parents should be. That's not how a family rocks. That's why Lance was like, yo, you're not my parents no more, and I respect that because they don't care about you. They only care about what you can do, your magic potential, and what you can do for them. They're selfish. That's not how. It reminds me of Attack on Titan with the parents of the, you know, uh, of the chosen ones, right? Like. They don't care, or or should we say the um the uh, Mar the fighters in Marley? You know what I mean? They don't care about you. They just want you to uh be better. They just want you to hit goals so they can live better, so they can be high class or valued. You know what I'm trying to say? And I respect that our boy Lance is trying to be a visionary so he can actually change things and make things better for those people who don't have magic because he's trying to protect his sister. That's respectable. And Mash could sense that. He could sense that Lance wasn't a bad guy. Even him throwing the bottle down and it was a fake goes to show you that. He's a good guy. I was literally watching it. I'm wondering, I'm like, yo, why did you start bullying people? Why are you doing this shit? This is literally not your character. And then they explained it to us so perfectly why he's on this path and why he's doing this. This was a really good episode, bro. Our boy Mash stay defying the laws of physics, bro. I swear to you, this dude can do anything and don't let him get in his gym gear. Once he in that outfit, it's over. It's done up. Thank you guys so, so much for watching this with me. If you made it to the end, you are amazing, yo. Peace! Oh